At this hour, a devastated wife remains by the bedside of her husband after he fell 35 feet down a well in Potrero. It's a story 10 News has been on top of since the dramatic rescue last night. New tonight, 10 News reporter Jennifer Jensen has the one sign of hope Jerry Fowler gave his wife from his hospital bed. Jessica Fowler tells 10 News she has stepped out of Sharp Memorial only two times in the past 24 hours. Once to buy a change of clothing, the second to give us an update on her husband's condition. Other than that, she's been by his side and says she will remain there until he wakes up. You're looking at family photos of 44-year-old Jerry Fowler, the same man you see here on a stretcher after Fowler fell 35 feet down a well in Petrero after the concrete crumbled around him. Why it gave out all of a sudden, I don't know, but that's what gave out. Fowler was flown by Mercy Air to Sharp Memorial Hospital, where he's already undergone two surgeries. He has fractures in the back, but they can't really do anything till they know with the brain, with the swelling in the brain, they have it under control. His wife Jessica says she will stay by his side no matter how long it takes. She shared with us what he did that offered her a sign of hope. He moved his hand this morning. He did squeeze my hand and he did move his arm. Fowler was pulled out of the well by an organized effort of firefighters from all over the county. Under here is a, one of our vaults that we have. We put personnel down inside here. Including Chula Vista's urban search and rescue crew from nearly an hour away. He's got this long umbilical cord that's connected to a box up here that has air supply on it. And our job is to make sure that our firefighter that goes down that well has a constant supply of air and communications with our team. Measures that were put into place to help bring Fowler out of that well. Still, Jessica says she'll take things day by day. I'm not sure what brings tomorrow until they come and talk to me in the morning. Near Kearney Mesa, Jennifer Jensen, 10 News.